Tony Stafari from the city of Derby on O'Sullivan Island, right underneath the uh, Route 8. Representative Themis Claritus. We're here at O'Sullivan Island to assess the damage that uh, was caused by the heavy rains and the snow melt that happened. Uh, basically, we're discussing about in regards to what, what needs to be done is a better line of communication from Stevenson Dam to uh, all the ways down the river so everybody's appropriately notified at the right time period. So this way it will lessen the damage and hopefully nobody ever gets hurt. I'll just try to do it in a common sense manner. And today we got together with obviously the mayor, myself, the other representatives and the congresswoman to, and a representative from FEMA to come so we can, the mayor can explain and show exactly what's going on here. Um, not just in this storm, this storm, but in prior storms and work with the federal government and the state to figure out how to help the people of, of the city of Derby and the surrounding areas. Take a ride with our firemen over here and show oh Yeah, the water was all, this was all underwater. The picnic benches were also underwater. As you can see, all the mud and stuff is all up here. It all washed up from the river. Yeah, my name is Mike Trash. And see, uh, the public works was actually nice enough to uh, shovel off some of the mud from the walkway so people could continue walking also. Some of the areas, because you're close to the water course in terms of regulatory effect, uh, are there any understandings that you, know, you have to impact some of the wetland buffer areas to the access? I'm sure the there areas? are, and those begin at the state level, what your state regulations so are, your DEP. DEP, that you start with those because uh, the federal government cannot come in and violate any of those state environmental laws. Uh, so they take precedence first before any of the federal laws come in.